All right, guys, in this short video, we're going to talk about onions, okay? Now, some people like onions, why others do not? Probably because of its smell. Whenever they are slicing onions, it makes them to cry, and then I'm just being sarcastic. But truth to be told, if you are not eating onions, your body is really missing out in some really interesting nutrients, all right? So why should you start eating onions? Well, onions contain thiosulfinate, which is an interesting compound. It's an interesting chemical that has blood thinning ability by preventing the formation of blood clots and also it helps to maintain the consistency of your blood. Let's, for example, you have blood clots in one of your artery. What happens is that artery becomes narrow. It becomes more difficult for blood to flow through it and that is going to create a whole lot of issue. Let's say it's one of your arteries in your brain that can actually result in stroke. But when you start consuming onions, which is a great source of thiosulfinate, that is going to help maintain the consistency of your blood. That is going to help prevent blood clots. All right. Now, the other interesting thing about this compound is that it is very anti-cancer. It can reduce the risk of developing certain type of cancer. Now, in one study that was published in 2019, I'm going to put a link of this study in the description below. Now, what they found out was that eating 32 pounds of onions in a year reduce colon cancer by 80 percent that is very very amazing so if you've not been eating onions before now you may actually want to reconsider eating it because it has a lot of interesting benefit now the other important thing about onions is that it's a great source of pyridoxine that is vitamin b6 now in every three months in every 120 days our red blood cells actually undergo destruction and new red blood cells are being formed now, vitamin B6, pyridoxine, is deeply involved in the formation of new red blood cells. So when you are deficient, that could actually result in shortage in your red blood cells, and then that is going to create a whole huge lot of issues. Now, the other interesting thing about eating onions is that they are great source of fiber, particularly the soluble fiber, which serves as prebiotics. They serve as foods for the, those friendly bacteria in your gut, your gut microbiome. Now, when your gut microbiome ferments this fiber, they are going to produce short-chain fatty acids, which helps to reduce inflammation, and also, it helps to improve colon health. Now, the other possible reason why you may want to start eating onions is that they are anti-asthmatic, all right? Now, asthma is a condition in which the airway becomes narrow. It becomes tightened. It becomes more difficult for air to pass through it. You struggle to take in more air, all right? Now, Onions might really be helpful, that's because they are great source of quercetin, which helps to reduce inflammation and suit those symptoms of asthma, right? Now, the last thing which I want to talk about is the ability to boost your immune system. Now, onions are a great source of polyphenols, vitamin C, quercetin, which are very good for your immune system. They support your immune system in fighting off bacteria and viruses which can cause infection. So when you start eating onions, they are going to start strengthening your immune system so that it can better able to neutralize bacteria and viral infection. All right. So these are some of the few benefits you get when you start eating onions. Beyond this, there are other lot of interesting benefits. All right. Thanks for watching.